Right then, I'm leaving Roebera Warren now and its tracks and woods and streams and heading up here to Tynings Stables where people go on horse rides. The horses are all out in the field now resting after probably been out. This cottage up here on the end looks doesn't look so good from this angle it just looks like a big wall of concrete but when you get around the front of it it's really pretty and it's got magnificent views all over there we've got ponies down there and over there all the horses are out now by the look of it normally quite a walk I do a lot is coming down from the, up there and then down a very bumpy path actually I'm quite glad and it's usually near an end of a walk so I'm quite glad I came this way very peaceful look at that blue sky everyone look at that isn't it lovely so I've emerged from the woods from the warren I'm now Piney Slights will be over there there's a farm but beyond there I've got to go is it is still I'd say it could still be two hours because I'm not rushing. I have no need to rush. So although it's just after five o'clock, if I don't get back to seven, it doesn't matter. It'll still be light and the chip shop will still be open. And Alberta will still be there. She's paid she's paid right up to, right up till tomorrow morning at nine o'clock, if necessary. on again. It's still quite warm even though it's uh, five o'clock. It's still quite warm. So I've had a really, this was one of the big walks to be quite honest. This this is, I mean if I'd done the road barrow hill for it that would have been even more, not, I'm not calling it worse, it, that would have been too much to have done the hill for it as well. But uh, what I've done is good. And at the moment, it's been an eight hour walk, going on for eight and a half hours since I first left Alberta. I left her about ten past nine this morning. Making the most of this beautiful day. And the horses look happy in the field. They look really happy. I'm going past this little farm now. This little cottage. I said, don't look much when you look at a concrete side, the rendering there. It's got gorgeous views across a valley and it looks very picturesque on this side and it will get the sun at a different time of the day. Beautiful garden. Beautiful. That's what I'd like. I'll never have. I bet at one time I could have. But, uh, not now. No. So that's the cottage. It's just a slight ill now, that's all. There's no hills. Once I get up here, there'll be no hills. There's those tall trees that stick out for miles, Rope Arrow Warren, one of my landmarks. I refer to them all the time. You can see them even when I'm on, walking on Sand Bay. If you look right over on the hills, you can see those trees reaching up to the sky. All the horses are out. All the horses are out. Oh, this has been a beautiful walk. A big walk. A beautiful walk, though. It's what you call a proper hike. No, don't forget, people fit would do it in half the time. I mean, I'm plodding. Very slow at times. And then taking photos. But I've been eating on the move. I haven't sat down, by the way. I haven't sat down once. No, I haven't sat down once since nine o'clock this morning. <sighs> yeah, it's been a long hike.
coming up to the farm. Right, I'm going to turn off for a bit. Look at all these either swifts or swallows. I think they're swallows. Hundreds of them look. Wow, that's amazing. All around that tree. I'll just zoom into the tree as a focal point. And all jumping around all around it is a whole army of... <sighs> they look like swifts, but they could be swallows. Look at them all. I've never seen so many. I can't remember the difference between a house martin, a swift and a swallow. Someone told me that the swallows were still here before they emigrate. Yeah, that's what they're doing. They're all gathering and then they go to South Africa or somewhere. Gathering on the line, look. I think they're swallows. I've never seen so many swallows in my life. Wow. That is so amazing. Yeah, they emigrate. Someone was telling me about it. They said they were surprised to see the swallows still here. Now, if we look right over there, there's Steep Home, look in the Bristol Channel. It's like I said, it's magnificent views from here and I've, of course I've recorded it all before. Of course I have. Look at them, there's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds. Bye then, lovely little swallows. I reckon you're swallows. Yeah, look at you all. Getting ready for your journey. Hey, going to back to, going to another hot country. God, look on the roof over there. Let me just zoom in on that roof. Look at all the swallows on that roof, everyone. That. Loads of them. I didn't think they could land. They must do sometimes the rest, surely. My God, they're all over the place. It's absolutely amazing. So beautiful. I think it's got the forked tail. I don't know. Oh, look, it's something. Excuse me.